everyone. Hey, Ed Fontes here. Hope you're having a great day. Hey, look what I have. I have the crystal ball. Oh man, look at that thing. That thing's turning hard. Hey, there's no such thing as a crystal ball. Where are you getting your information from, folks? What crystal ball do you have? There's no such thing. We go off of facts, data, and the market. What we have seen and what we told you prior, we were gonna see a 3% appreciation by the end of the year in all properties. And why am I saying about this? Because we just found out right now, we have a four to five and a half percent appreciation from the gurus currently right now across the nation. That's huge. That's huge for every property owner right now. Now, not only that, but in some areas it's even more. For example, our Sacramento region. We've seen properties 5, 10, 15, 20% appreciation. We've seen bids, five, six, seven, 10 offers, over bids on a property, trying people vying to get into a home. That's great news, folks. Maybe not for you as a buyer that's been, you know, I've got buyers that are looking at 20, 25 properties and, and finally getting into one. But for you that are refinancing or thinking of refinancing, it's time to jump off the fence. Why? Because we just had a reprieve, a reprieve from HAFA, FAFA, Federal Housing Finance Agency. Try saying that three times. And they basically were going to, or they're going to increase the refinance rates by half a point, half a percentage. That's huge. In other words, if we're at uh, two and a half percent on a refi, you're going to be at three percent on a refi now. Folks, it's time to jump off the fence. This is the time that you've been waiting for. The rates are not gonna drop anymore as we are looking and seeing what's going on with this economy. We are recovering. We, and I mentioned to that in prior videos, this was an induced pandemic situation, folks. Had nothing to do with the economy. You guys, the factories were going gun ho that we haven't seen in 60 years. The lowest unemployment rate. All walks of life employed, folks. And you know what I mean about that. The bottom line is, and I said in the past, when we recover, we are going to have a huge recovery. It's going to be the greatest it's ever been for a long time. And we are seeing that now. Why? Because we've seen the biggest manufacturing increase in July. What does that mean, folks? That means people that are buying homes, new homes. Why aren't you looking at new homes? Anyways, people that are buying new homes or regular homes, it doesn't matter. What are you going to do? You're going to go out and buy some big ticket items refrigerators, washers, dryers, lawn mowing equipment, patios. You're going to buy equipment. You're going to have services done. People that come and help and work in your home to make it your home. Thus increasing the economy and putting people back to work. That's all there is, folks. There's no secrets. There's no crystal ball. It's just a matter of what you're doing out there. Now, those that are refinancing, we need to get you in. We need to lock your loan. We need to get you in and see if it makes sense. I had a client, we just, she bought a house a year ago in July, this, and a year and a month later, she has 55,000 equity in her property, besides the amount she put down. That's huge, 55,000 in equity. There's, she's telling me, Ed, there's no way I could have saved that amount in that short a period of time. I agree, no way. Unless, you know, you make a lot of money, you've got a business and all that. No, she's a regular wage earner. The bottom line is, is we saved her over $250 a month on her house payment, folks, eliminating the private mortgage insurance. She's just flabbergasted, cannot believe it. And, and she was so glad that last year we told her, buy now. It doesn't matter where rates are at, buy now because appreciation of equity. Now, those of you that are thinking, you should jump off the fence because I'm gonna tell you whether it makes sense or not. We had our, our past clients last week thinking about it. They already had a low rate, came in and they were only gonna save $79 a month to get in the mid twos. Does it make sense? Of course not. They'd have to stay in that house for what, eight to 10 years to recoup the closing cost on that loan. It's not worth it sometimes folks. And we will tell you that whether it's worth it or not. And some areas we've seen, like I said, appreciation, maybe your area may not have appreciated as much. We'll let you know that as well. We're here to help you. We're here to get things going. We're here in case you have any family, friends, relatives, and coworkers that we can help. Please share this video. Have a great day, everyone. Be blessed.